Her passion for animals started from a young age, and after seeing grooming up close working for a vet, she knew it was what she wanted to do. Now, 33 years later, her last day will be at the end of the month, and she says her love for her customers and their animals made this decision incredibly difficult. The iconic pink doors of KK's doghouse and temple. For owner Karen Thomas, the shop is a sanctuary of care. This has been the hardest part. Thomas says after 33 years in the grooming business, the physical toll on her body has caught up to her and says next month will be her shop's last. My shoulders, my hands, everything just told me it was time to. Thomas says she originally started off bathing dogs, but learned the trade of grooming along with her mother back in 1989. And the rest is history. I've always loved my customers, friends, and their babies like they were my own. Thomas says she serviced thousands of animals and never advertised her business once. It just grew by word of mouth. We would do 20, 25 dogs a day, and it was just overwhelming. Thomas says her customer base has expanded exponentially over the years, and she says she hopes they'll find another groomer that cares for their animals like she has. We've had dogs come in here that were so matted, it looked like they had dreadlocks on them. And those dogs, when we finish getting that hair off them, they turn around and lick us all over the face, like thanking us. Thomas says her sister has organized a retirement party for September 30th at the shop, one day after what will be her last day of grooming. And I'm probably just gonna sit there and cry the whole time. The last day of operation for KK's Doghouse will be September 29th. And September 30th, they'll be holding a farewell retirement party at the shop from 10 a.m. to 2, Bailey.